Yeah, as if Donald would go out on his own. Gorge, Jiminy. Your world disappeared, too. It was terrible. We were scattered. And as far as I can see, I'm the only one who made it to this castle. Oh, right. I gotcha. You mean while we're in other worlds, we can't let on where we're from, huh? We gotta protect the world border. Right. World border. I don't know. I think world border sounds just as good as well, don't you guys? I think that works. Yes, we'll need new duds when we get there. Oh. Yeah, that's pretty much just a an excuse to get them out of their court gear and into more classic outfits, more what we're used to. And there's Chip and Dale. But where's Gizmo and Monterey? Monterey, right? That's his name? I think so. The other chipmunks? I think it's a little sad that Chip and Dale don't have speaking parts. I would have loved to have heard their voices too, and they're both upside down. Ruby's just going along with it. Donald is not happy. Pluto dis apparently decided to tag along. And now, you would think, the way the ship is oriented, and the fact that they seem to have a launch tube right in front of them, that that's the way they're going when they launch. But no. Even Donald thought they were going straight ahead. And then they drop down below and pop out the bottom of the world here in just a second. Yeah, that's what the Magic Kingdom looks like from space, apparently. There we go. Okay. Now we get the only ever mention of Sora's parents, as well as the only look into his bedroom. This is how you know they don't actually live on the island from Destiny Island. I just can't they wait. live somewhere else. Once we set sail, it'll be great. A storm? Oh no! The raft! So what I want to know is how is... There's Sora's mom. Again, this is the only mention we ever hear of her. But what I, what I want to know is if the island is visible from Sora's bedroom window, how come his house is not visible from the island? Okay? At the least, from the island, we should be, should be able to see another land mass. What's that? But we can't. If you look out at the horizon. Riku's boat. And Kairi's. Ah, and the Heartless appear. Which you can't attack now. No matter how hard you try, you can't hurt them. Because all you have is a wooden sword. And there is that door from the dream covering the entrance to the secret place. And over here is Riku. Ah, get off me. Where's Kairi? I thought she was with you. The door is open. What? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. I'm not afraid of the darkness. Heh. <laughs> It's not you that should uh, fear the darkness, nor the darkness fear you. It's Sora who has to fear the darkness. And then again, the, the darkness has to fear Sora, so... I'm trying to reach Riku. I, I can't I can't quite get him. Come on, just, just stretch a little bit further. Come on, come on. Oh, 
Oh, no. Oh. Too much darkness between us. There's a light! There's a light! What is it? What is this bright light? It's a giant freaking key. Seriously? It's a key, right? Yeah, yeah, it's a key. It's the Keyblade. Yeah, see? Even it says, Keyblade. Keyblade. Now, a Keyblade does not work as an actual weapon. Yet, somehow it has the power to hurt Heartless, so... Like, if you wanted to use it as a proper sword, it wouldn't work. You're pretty much just, like, swinging around a baseball bat with, uh, a block of steel on the end. However, it does work well against the Heartless, like I just said. Now, I believe, uh, even though each group of Heartless is not infinite, I believe if you continually walk around the island, the groups will respawn. So it's a good way to grind early on if you need to, or, or if you feel you need to and whatnot. We're not necessarily going to grind here. Uh, a good rule of th thumb is to get to like level 5 on normal, and I believe level 10 on hard. I believe we're on like level 4, or, or we may even be 5 right now. Let's take a look. Yeah, we're level 4. Just 31 away. Like I said, I'm not going to grind. But I am gonna, gonna destroy any Heartless I encounter. Come here. Oh, come on. There we go. Actually, there's something I wanted to check. Abilities. Oh, no abilities. Okay. No abilities at this point. There we go. We got a potion. Potions are good. Come here. Get back here. There we go. Didn't want that. May as well kill this guy too. Ah. Get out of here. There we go. Gotcha. Now there's another one here. Another two. I'm here. Gotcha. Okay, we didn't reach level five. Like I said, I'm not going to grind for it. Instead, what we need to do is go through here to the secret place. And that brown door... Kyrie doesn't look so good. Oh, the door has opened. And Kyrie's disappeared in thin air. And Sora gets blown away. Where are we? Well, believe it or not, we're still technically on Destiny Islands. The, uh, the place is being destroyed. And I believe it's being destroyed by this guy. Who we now have to fight again. He's a little bit tougher than last time, but not too much. There we go. Ooh. So far, so good. Come on. Come on, put your hand down. Come on. There we go. Now he put his hand down. Come on. Stop hitting me, Shadow Heartless. There we go. Two level ups, it looks like. Now we're level six. And we learned a new ability, too, which we can't use right now because we're in the middle of a cutscene. 
But it's a useful one, the sliding dash. Come on, Sarah, hold on. You can do it, you can do it. Don't let go, no, no! You weren't supposed to let go, man! Yeah, Sora unfortunately let go. Yep, that was Destiny Islands. And now we're in a new place. Welcome, my friends, to Traverse Town. This is pretty much like the hub world of this game. You'll be coming back and uh, forth from here oh, quite a bit during our adventures. Maybe we ought to go find Leon. Oh, Donald, uh, you know, I bet you that... Ah, uh... uh, what do you know, you big brother cat? What do I know? Uh, not much. On, but, road. if you had gone that way, sure you wouldn't have found Leon. But you, you might have found the one with the key, right? I mean, look, look, Pluto's found him already, see? There he is, there's Sora. Dream. Nope. Oh, where am I? Oh boy. Do you know where we are? Oh, hey. You might know, but he's not telling you. So, anyways, now we get to explore Traverse Town. This is totally weird. I'm in another world. So yeah, Traverse Town's broken up into three districts. This is the first district. And there is a chest over here. I have no idea how to open it. I think it has something to do with the flames on these candles, but I honestly have no idea because no matter what I try to do, I can't get them all to go out all at once. And I think that's how you open it up is you, you get all the, the candles to go out at once. Uh, on the ground here is a blue trinity mark. Uh, you do have to complete all the trinities, find all the trinities in order to get the secret ending. That's one of the, the things you have to do. So what's this kid have to say? You looking for someone? It's a big town, so check everywhere. And the Moogle might explain things for us. Shadows destroyed my world. I've got nowhere to go, Koopo. So yeah, this says up there see you again so this is pretty much the exit of the world but we can't leave right now there's another blue trinity mark now we can't unlock trinities yet we need goofy and donald to do that and this uh area is blocked off as well that's the entrance to uh the third quarter from or the third district from uh traverse town or from the first district i mean over here we have a mailbox. Send 10 postcards to win something. Good luck. Now in the accessory shop is our next bit of information. With Sid, Highwind from Final Fantasy VII. Hey there, how can I... Aw, oh, it's only a kid. I'm not a kid, and the name's Sora. Uh, hate to tell you, you are. You are, you are, yeah, you are a kid. Okay, okay, simmer down. So why the long face, Sora? You lost or something? No. Well, maybe. Where are we? Huh? Traverse Town. So, Gramps, is this really another world? Don't call me Gramps. The name's Sid. Anyway, not sure what you're talking about, but this sure ain't your island. Hmm. Guess I'd better start looking for Riku and Kairi. Well, good luck with whatever it is you're doing. If you ever run into trouble, you come to me. I'll look out for you. Okay, and here we have a save point. We're going to go ahead and save here. <laughs>